Right now at 6, arrests for driving under the influence continue to climb in our state. Just last year in El Paso County alone, 900 arrests, nearly double the year before. We're taking a hard look at this incredibly dangerous behavior as we continue to work toward driving change on Colorado's roadways, looking for the problems all of you face every day and how we can look for solutions. Good evening, and tonight we are focusing on that driving under the influence problem and why repeat offenders are staying on the road so long. Elizabeth with more tonight. El Paso County has the highest rate of deadly DUIs in the state. And in Colorado, if you're caught drunk driving, it doesn't become a felony until your fourth arrest. And after we dug into the numbers, we found there are a lot of those repeat offenders. How much did you have to drink today? Maybe too much. What were you drinking? What lights did you have today, sir? Three. Maynard Rome there in prison now serving a four year sentence after he entered a guilty plea after his 13th DUI arrest. Records show over three decades he had two DUIs in South Dakota and 11 in the Denver area. It took him 13 arrests to get sent to prison because his most recent one came after a law from 2016 made a fourth DUI a felony in Colorado, forcing offenders to spend at least 90 days in jail, complete at least 48 hours of community service, and pay for and complete an alcohol treatment program. And state records show the numbers of felony DUI cases. Check out these numbers of the cases filed since Colorado made four DUIs a felony. They show 5,000 people have hit that fourth DUI, and that's just who's been caught. There's much more to this problem. At 10, I'm finding out what's being done to help rehab these drivers and how can we make the streets safer for all of us. We hope you'll join us then as we continue this conversation. And remember, all 2020 will be driving change, addressing issues on our roads and working to find solutions to make the drive better for all of us. We have had tremendous feedback from you already. Dozens of ideas we'll be working on, but keep those ideas coming in the comments. Email us your thoughts and concerns at drivingchange at koaa.com or leave a message on our Driving Change Facebook page.